welcome back to my channel today sorry guys the intro is gonna be a little screaming because every single time i pull out the camera Kyrie purposely screams and i i can't find my way around it I, I don't know what to do i'm just but i have to film so yeah today we're meal prepping as we have been for the last three weeks so we're actually in front of fresh time right now we're gonna go and grab a few things that i need for our meal prep this week and if you're new here welcome to my channel i am doing Doing keto and low carb and I've lost 18 pounds in the last two months like eight weeks um, and meal prepping has been helping me so much so I hope you guys enjoy this video let's go into a fresh time get some things and then we'll go home and we will meal prep for the week so let's go and if you're new my name is Micah <laughs> and this is Kyrie <laughs> All right guys, so here's everything I got from Fresh Time this morning. I just got things that I needed. I still do have things here at home um, for the meal prep that's not in this little shopping hall. So I got chicken sausage. I'm gonna be using these for my breakfast this week for my meal prep. I grabbed some more Car Balance flour tortillas. These have four grams of net carbs, very high in fiber and only 70 calories. We're gonna be using this for my lunch. I got these roasted seaweed because I just love seaweed and they're such a great snack. For the whole thing, there's only like 20 calories and no carbs and they were on sale for 99 cents. So I got two of these and I do like to eat these with my salmon. This is not low carb, but I brought these for the kids um, so they can snack on. And then I have been seeing these all over TikTok, but these are the zero carb tortillas. They did have like these taco size tortillas um, and they only had like one and a half grams of net carbs, but these, are, these have zero. We've got some petite carrots, really good snack. We'll be having that for my snack this week. And then I found this bitchin' sauce, guys. This is really keto friendly and it's low carb. Um, they have so many flavors. I grabbed the buffalo, but there is like original, um, chipotle, um, and just like other, other flavors. But I got the buffalo, so we're gonna have that with the carrots for our snack this week. And then guys, I've been obsessed with black mussels lately. They're really low on carb and they fill me up. They're so good and I just love like seafood. We have just a little thing of Kerrygold butter. Guys, I can't wait to show you guys this, but these are like big, thick, huge, beautiful fillets of salmon. It's only $14. We've got onion, lemon. So we're gonna be using this for our lunch this week. So. I needed pizza sauce for our meal prep this week. And so it was either out of this, which was $1.59. Um, and yes, it does have carbs. So for one fourth of a cup, there's only 30 calories. And um, let's see, four grams of net carbs. So again, this was a dollar. The Rouse pizza sauce was $6 for the same size. And it had two grams of carbs. So I'm like, $1? For six dollars so we we went with this so just trying to save money there <laughs> I've been seeing people drink the hint water there's uh, zero everything zero calories uh, zero carbs sugar so we'll try it only about one so I'll let you guys know and then we've got some turkey meatballs maybe I'll make this for the kids tonight and make um, spaghetti for them if not I'll save it for like next week's meal prep and then I got a bag of broccoli and then this cheesy rice cauliflower and broccoli. Um, so let's see, for the whole container, there's only 80 calories, which is really, really good. Um, and then six grams of net carbs for the whole thing. So that's pretty good. But yeah, this is what I got from Fresh Time, guys. All right, let's begin our breakfast meal prep. Okay guys, we have three. I only like to make three and then I'm gonna actually eat this one today. But I only make three meal preps because like by day three, I'm over it. I'm not gonna eat it. I don't want food to go to waste. So I just make three of everything. 
and then the other two days out of the week I find out something else to eat um, but yeah these are convenient if I'm like going into the office but okay uh, eggs are done as you guys saw sorry I was filming on, filming on my phone because my camera died but I did a total of seven eggs I added a little bit of milk spinach onion green peppers salt pepper garlic um, and spinach lots of spinach so I'm just waiting for my chicken sausage right now in the air fryer all right guys so this is my breakfast meal prep for the week something very easy and simple I have my chicken sausage scrambled eggs with spinach green pepper onions and one cherry tomato I can really pair this with like um, a tortilla or I can just eat it like this, add some avocado, but this is just what I have for now. And then I'm also gonna have this bowl for breakfast today. Just having my collagen I really love to have my perfect electrolytes and also a glass of this pomegranate collagen so when I'm not having my perfect keto electrolytes I'm having my perfect keto super reds that has collagen in it so cheers to that so I know I always talk about how important it is for me to stay hydrated and getting my electrolytes in but Another important thing that I am learning as I am getting older, so I'm 28 now, I'm getting really close to 30, everyone needs collagen. Collagen is super critical to our bones, our joints, our ligaments, our tendons, also our hair, our skin, our nails. So as we all age, including myself, including you guys, the natural collagen levels that we already produce they go down and lucky for us we can supplement with high quality collagen powder so not only these super reds but everything behind me is high quality collagen powder so I wanted to share this amazing deal with you guys by perfect keto and in my opinion this is one of the best sales that they are having it's not really a sale you're actually getting all of these for free so for a limited time if you purchase any single item um, on perfectketo.com you have to use my link below though i'm gonna have my link in my description box you have to click that because there's no discount code or anything once you click that link it'll take you to perfect keto and then all you need to do is just buy one single item from perfectketo.com using my link and then at the end this amazing collagen sampler pack will be sent to you for free and again it's limited time only so the sale is good from today and it ends tuesday october 3rd so if you're out there and you're looking for collagen and you don't want to buy like a huge tub or a huge pack of this because you're just unsure of how you know the flavor is or if it's really going to help this is the perfect 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 way to try it so again you buy one item and you will be sent a five pack of this collagen sampler with your order. The only thing you will have to pay for is shipping, which is $7.99, but the sampler itself is free. So I want you guys to check out my description box. Please check this sale out. It's good for a whole week. Um, and that way you guys can try collagen by Perfect Keto and you guys can figure out which collagen you guys love. Okay, I'm gonna finish my collagen drink and we'll get back to the meal prep. Now that breakfast is done, we're gonna head right into lunch and we're gonna meal prep our lunch because I only have four hours um, until Kyrie wakes up. I actually have about two and a half hours now. So I, I wanna just get everything out of the way today because it's Sunday and baby's sleeping. So yeah, we're gonna just head right into lunch and then right, head right into dinner. Okay, so for lunch, super easy, super simple. We're gonna make low carb Hot Pockets. So we're just gonna make three. So we've got three here, and you guys can use any cheese, but I just happen to have provolone. Um, you can also use mozzarella cheese, that would be really good. 
And then this is the pizza sauce I'm gonna use. And then we're also gonna do pepperoni. Okay, so we are going to cut our cheese first. We'll probably cut this in threes. We're actually going to make our little butter mixture now. So we're gonna use about two tablespoons of butter. So then we're gonna add some pizza sauce. And you don't necessarily have to do pepperoni and provolone. You can do salami, whatever you want. So we'll just put that there. Okay, so I've got butter here, guys. Kerrygold butter, about two tablespoons, and then we're gonna add Italian seasoning. And then I'm just going to add this butter Italian wash. All right, so that is what it looks like. And then we're just gonna throw these in the air fryer. 375 for like six minutes. Okay guys, so this is how the Hot Pockets look. I'm gonna actually cut one open for you guys so you guys can see the inside. I'm gonna wrap them in this like wax paper, but I just wanna show you guys, like, look at that. Do you guys hear that? How crisp that is? And look at that, guys. Look at this gooey cheese. What a fun little way to enjoy a Hot Pocket while you're watching <laughs> your carbs. Wow. Also guys, this Hot Pocket. Mm. Mm. So, so good. I should have made like six of these. <laughs> guys look at how thick the salmon is it is so thick i'm so excited these were only 4.99 each I haven't used Dijon mustard in so long on my salmon, but this gives your salmon a really nice crisp. And it tastes so good. I'm not really like a huge fan of like Dijon mustard, but on salmon, it's so good. And this is a different little brush, guys. Seriously, guys. Try it, coat your salmon with Dijon mustard. It's so good. It just makes like the perfect crust. This one's gonna be a little bit lower. We're gonna do 364. Let's do about 14 minutes first. Okay guys, it's been about 10 minutes. We're gonna add Kerrygold butter to the top and then we are going to add just a little bit of lemon. All right guys, salmon is done. Do you guys see that nice brown crust? That's what the Dijon mustard does to it. Sorry, I added some lemon <laughs> and we got some pulp in there, but I'm just going to let this sit for a little and then we'll figure out our sides. All right guys, I'm just going to let this sit in this container to cool off and then we'll figure out what we will make or prep for the salmon. Hi you guys, so it's actually the next day. Um, it's Monday morning. When I did my meal prep yesterday, the last thing I did was make the salmon in the air fryer and then I just kind of threw it in like a large container. So today I'm going to meal prep 
the salmon. I'm making something different every day of the week and I'll show you guys what I'm talking about. Um, so yeah, let's take a look at the salmon. Okay, so I just threw the salmon in here and then I also made some mussels. But um, yeah, we're going to separate the salmon and prep for our dinners this week. So the first thing we're gonna make is what I had last week, exactly, but we're just gonna make one of those. So I have leftover collie mash here that I made a few days ago, and then green beans that I made a few days ago as well. So everything's already cold. So it's perfect. So like two large handfuls of romaine lettuce. So this one is simple and then when I'm ready to eat it, I'll just add all of my toppings. Um, whether it's like Parmesan cheese, uh, dressing, bacon bits, cucumbers, but I'm just gonna prep it like this for now. And then for today's salmon, we're doing cauliflower rice. And then we are doing salmon with that. And so for this one, I'll show you guys what we're pairing it with. I'm gonna actually be having the salmon bowl with the seaweed and the spicy mayo. I like to make my own spicy mayo with this uh, kewpie sauce or mayo and then sriracha. And then we're gonna use seaweed, but I know you've guys seen me eat this before or maybe you've seen it on TikTok, but um, you basically just kind of mush everything together with the rice and you can use regular rice. I'm just choosing to use cauliflower rice, obviously because it's low carb and keto friendly. And then you just add your sauces, your mayo, your sriracha, and then you just kind of eat it with that. And so, yeah, I'm actually gonna have this for dinner tonight. So this is my meal prep for dinner for the week. All salmon meals, different types of meals, just so it doesn't get too boring. I did really enjoy this combination all last week. I wouldn't mind eating this again all week, um, but I did wanna change it up a little bit. So yeah, this is my dinner meal prep. And before we end the video, I just wanna show you guys my favorite snacks and some new snacks that I love just munching and eating throughout the day that is low carb. I bought this huge pack of peppered beef jerky from Sam's, it's 18 ounces and this was like $15. Um, but for a serving, so about one ounce, I'd say about maybe two good pieces is about one ounce. There is six grams of carbs, 11 grams of protein, and only 70 calories. And then I always like to pair that with nuts. This is the uh, salted nuts. So for about 23 pieces, I probably only have like maybe 10. Um, there is five grams of net carbs for uh, per serving. So if I only eat about half of the serving, there's like what, two and a half uh, carbs. And then this one's new, but I'm gonna be enjoying it this week too. This is the Buffalo Bitchin Sauce that I showed you guys earlier with my uh, fresh thyme haul and then pairing it with baby petite carrots. So yeah, just a few snack ideas that I'm going to be snacking on throughout the week. All right guys, and that is the video. I hope you guys enjoyed this week's meal prep video. I will be filming probably about two videos this week just to show you guys what I eat on the days where I don't eat my meal prep. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed these videos, these recipes, these meals. Jot them down, let me know if you try them at home. And I know I've just been loving salmon. I have just noticed eating salmon is just literally literally melting the weight off. So I have just been eating it because that's just what's been working for me and I find it delicious. I'll probably get sick of it soon, but as of this week, I'm not yet. <laughs> so anyways, thank you guys so, so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.